It's funny, isn't it? That people will ask you, how are you? When actually, we don't even know who we are. Or what we are. You are living on borrowed breath. The borrowed breath of God. That eternal spiritual breath is your soul. And without it, we are simply lifeless shapes. See, we are so concerned about these temporary bodies, aren't we? We shelter them, we dress them in clothes, we wash them, we do their hair. We lie them down in beds and try our best to give them eight hours of rest. We feed them and try to fill them up, but we forget about the health of our very souls. This is our essence, the part of us that is decision maker, choice bearer, the center of every emotion, moral and desire. It's the core from where you cry from. It's the reason you laugh. It's why you long for love. It's you, it's yours. So you choose what to do with it. So, is your soul full? If someone shone a light through your soul, what would you see on the wall of the world? Would it cast confused silhouettes? Maybe a culture-controlled shadow puppet? Or would you radiate heaven's kaleidoscope? You were born to be a living prism, absorbing the pure white light of Christ and disperse every God color into the world around you. Your soul can be illuminated and refract the colors of love, joy, peace, and patience. You can pour out the deep shades of goodness and mercy and every good thing that comes from the Father of that heavenly light. Let God purify the prism that is your soul and you will shine the colors of the kingdom kaleidoscope. You will be the rainbow of redemption to a world longing for the greatest treasure. It's your chance to shine, to go glowing into all the world. Thank you.